Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Aquarius. This is for Aquarius Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is a love reading. Um, this reading may or may not be for you. Uh, we're just going to see what comes up. We're going to start right here. We're going to get one of these, one of these, and use that deck right there. This is for some time in January. Um, let's just see what we got. If you are in a happily ever after relationship, then this reading is not for you. What do we have for Aquarius for January? What do we have for Aquarius in regards to love? Ooh, thinking about it. Thinking, 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 thinking. So you may have your, you know, you're thinking about somebody. If you are the female, you obviously um, are wondering what you want to do next. Whether you want to keep doing this, whether you want to close this chapter. You, If you are the male, you could be dealing with a woman that is wondering if she wants to continue. That's what I feel like this is. This person is it's a, this person is an open book. Okay, the feminine is an open book, and they're they're probably wondering what should I do? Do I want to keep doing this, or do I want to start a new chapter? Do I want to start a new story? Do I do? Is this what I really want? So I feel like the feminine is thinking about, really, really thinking about her future. So, if you are the masculine, you may want to keep that in mind. Whoever you're dealing with that is feminine, um, is a feminine energy. This person is is really contemplating what they should do. They're they're really unsure of their next move, and they're thinking about: Do I want to do this or not? Is this really what I want? Is it? Do I, am I really interested in this? Or they may have read something that has put them in a state of contemplation, you know what I mean? Maybe they read something that has made them take a double take, you know? Hmm, that kind of, hmm, that's what this is. So, interesting. What do we have for Aquarius? I don't know if you're dealing with a Capricorn, but I just, I, w I wanted to say Capricorn, so I don't know. Justice, justice. Wow. Now this is the law getting involved. Okay. You notice there's some been some sort of car wreck. Um, we have somebody here that is trying to bring balance to a situation. Um, you could be dealing with a Libra as well. There's some sort of fighting going on. There's some sort of rage by the looks of things. This might have been road rage. There's some sort of a situation where there's a lot of, uh, well, there's some problems here. We got some problems that are being uh, dealt with. You may be dealing with a legal issue, okay, in which, you know, there the law needs to get involved. And maybe you're dealing with a person that isn't sure if they want to deal with it. Maybe you're thinking that. Somebody is like, hmm, I'm not sure if I want to get involved in this mess. It could definitely be a mess. Um, somebody probably was acting recklessly or something like that. Something happened. Somebody was, was, I mean, there, there could definitely, I mean, there could be a car accident. This is a love reading, but I'm just saying there's reckless behavior here. Somebody acted recklessly and now, uh, this is a card of karma. It's a card of justice. It's a card of integrity. It's about making a decision. It's about, um, consequences as well. This is mitigation. You may be going through a, a situation where there's going to be some sort of mitigation, but this is a legal issue that is that is on the table here that is coming to the surface, okay? So there, there could be some fighting. There could be an argument. There could be something that happens that needs mitigation. Um, what do we have for Aquarius here? Now, justice is all about law and order. Okay, it's about integrity, and that is also, you know, there could be even be a divorce or a split or something that is coming up. Oh my God, there is some sort of truth that is coming out. This is the sort of truth. It's a, it's a sort of power. This is a wake up call. This is a new idea or a new thought or a taking a new approach. But this is also the sword that cuts. It cuts right through the, you know what. So something, this is some sort of truth coming out. Some sort of truthful communication is going to be delivered. 
Oh, justice reverse. So something. So, oh my God. So this is uh, this. There's unfair treatment. There's there's something that probably may may not have gone in your favor. Perhaps there was a legal uh, issue that didn't go in your favor. Um, but it was fair and just, and you may somebody may not see it that way. And this is seeing things taking, seeing a new, seeing things differently. So, this is interesting. Hangman reversed. I just gotta get some more cards here. This is about all that is practical and real and solid and stable. There's some some painful situation here. This is painful. Stormy weather, heartache, heartbreak. It feels as though we have somebody here that hasn't been treated fairly. They were lied to. This is lies. The justice reversed. Somebody's uh, there's uh, there's arguments with no resolution, and I see there's arguments here. So this is like there's no resolution here because the truth needs to come out. Somebody hasn't been telling the truth, and when the truth comes out that's when there will be resolution so somebody hasn't been telling the truth the hangman reversed is refusing to go in sorry I just shut that it should stop in a minute I don't know why it hasn't sorry that's some rude person that has decided that they can call me out of line anyhow um, this is, this is some sort of punishment, perhaps a new perspective is needed, but somebody is refusing to tell the truth. They're refusing to act with integrity, refusing to do the right thing. But this is the sort of truth. So some sort of truth is going to come out that is going to bring justice. It's going to bring balance, but somebody has been reluctant to tell, this is reluctant to tell the truth. They've been sacrificing themselves needlessly. There's definitely some fighting here. There's there's fighting, 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 fighting going on. A lesson needs to be learned, but somebody is refusing. They're hiding. They're obsessed with whatever it is that they're hanging on to. Really struggling to let go. Maybe it's to let go of a contract that they are married to or signed up for. There's definitely some heartbreak here, needing to be practical. It's not going to be easy. It's not going to be easy. But somebody is trying to stay in a super safe situation that really isn't practical. This is heartache. Somebody's heart is breaking over an injustice. Oh my God, there's got, this is a permanent loss. The tower reverse is a permanent loss. Somebody is going to extremes and they could be experiencing some health problems. Definite fights here. So if you, somebody is in a relationship that is false, it's a false sense of security and they're staying in it just for the looks of it. This is a painful change that is needed and somebody is is like totally refusing to honor their truth, having a really, really, really hard time letting go. And it's like, this is getting bad luck because you're not acting in a practical way. You're not being realistic. You're not acting with integrity. I'm not saying it, it, it could be you. It could be the other person. We have somebody here that is not acting with integrity and they're going to experience some bad karma. They really are karmic consequences. And they're going to, it's like things are going to crumble and it's going to, it's going to end. It's something is going to end in a drastic way because somebody is resisting it so much. What you resist persists and it persists more and more and more. They will keep throwing catalysts at you and causing fights and causing accidents that cause problems in the relationship until you honor your true self and uh, until you be truthful and honest with what you need. So anyway, Aquarius, this is a permanent loss. It really is. And this is something happening that you never saw coming. So I'm not sure if it is an accident or something. You know, something could happen that you, you didn't see it coming. You definitely need to be careful here. Move slow. Don't move fast. This is move slow. Um, now, 
something to do with the family. So this permanent loss could have to do with your family or your job or your money or something like that because this is an establishment of some sort that has uh, been around for some time. Uh, there's uh, stability, there's, there's a built up foundation, but it's crumbling. So somebody's foundation is crumbling. And they've been resisting it because of the assets, because of the things, because of society, because of the family. That's why it's been resisted for so long. But it is crumbling. It is absolutely crumbling. And this could be at work. This could be at work. There could be a corporation that is falling apart. Maybe you work for this corporation. This could be um, something in the government. If you work for the government, something is definitely falling apart. It's like a fall from stability. It's, it's seriously. This structure is no longer stable. This foundation is no longer stable. Somebody, ha, ah, that's abuse. That is mental abuse. That is verbal abuse. That is physical abuse or either or that is mental, 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 never heard of that one, right? Mental, verbal, physical, neglectful, abusive individual. Somebody that is cold and uncaring and withdrawn and doesn't have a lot of heart. This person is somehow involved in this resistance. This person may have some sort of control over you. Some sort of power. Maybe they're a narcissist. Doesn't have to be. This person is very forceful. Very intelligent as well. So very manipulative. We, it, we, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius... This and this does this could be anybody. It doesn't have to be Libra, Gemini. We have Pisces here. We have Libra, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Scorpio. We have Libra a few times. I don't know if you're dealing with a Libra, but there is an unjust situation. It's not fair. Somebody is not owning up to their true integrity. I feel like there's going to be a legal loss, or there has been. And where somebody's not going to be happy with the outcome. They're not going to be happy with the outcome. They're going to feel like, you know, these people are corrupt or something like that. If this part portion of it is for you, I feel like there's some sort of, uh, well, there's definitely some lies here. So there, there could be even be some legal flaws that don't, that, uh, go against you. There's a definitely a level of uh, unaccountability and dishonesty here. Placing blame. Somebody may be placing the blame on everybody but themselves. We definitely have somebody here that is... There is a lot of fighting and blaming and uh, animosity here within a family unit or a relationship. There absolutely is. And things are about to crash and it's going to crash hard. This person may falsely accuse. They may falsely accuse somebody of abuse. It may be false. But the truth comes out. Okay, there is some sort of wake it, awakening or truth that is going to come out. I think there's going to be somebody may file for divorce. Or somebody may get hurt, you know. Because this is heartbreak. This is a painful separation that must happen. It is the most practical thing to do. So I be prepared to receive news about a legal uh, thing. Okay, somebody's about to file papers, whether it's you or the other person. This is also the laws of karma with both of these justice cards. There is some sort of karma. Somebody is getting some karma. My advice is to be honest and upfront and tell the truth. The person that lies is going to get hurt really bad. 
So anyway, with that with that tower reversed, there is going to be a permanent loss. Something is going away. There could be even some sort of exposure of a crime because we got this five of swords on the bottom. Somebody, you know, could tattletale or tell because of vindictiveness. There's de this is definitely somebody is involved in a volatile situation. Somebody could get arrested. Somebody ha hasn't been listening, they haven't been heeding a warning, or they haven't been paying attention, and there's going to be some sort of uh, disruptive, explosive situation that calls in the law, or something like that. Whatever. Good luck, Aquarius. Aquarius.